Good evening, my beautiful riders of the light. Why that title? I'll come to much later on. Today's download is called Moving Beyond Transactions. I have about three points to share, so bear with me. Number one, higher consciousness way of life and living cannot be perceived if all interaction is based on a transaction mindset, if every relationship, interaction between humans or collectives as a society is based on what I give and how much I receive by each side, not only will the net progress made in society be very slow, very painful and very elongated, but will also have no room for higher consciousness in it. At the moment, in this reality, in 2022, every kind of human interaction and relationship is essentially a transactional approach. A shopkeeper mentality, a trader or a financier mentality. And that will beget mirrored results, meaning what you do, you get the same thing in return. You have a transactional approach and all you get back from others around you and society will be a transactional approach. How, what do I get from you? etc. And it will provide only a myopic experience of life and living. The resulting imbalance is what is propagating itself through the civilization. Number two, the best educator of harmonious abundant life and living for you at this time can only be nature. Why? Because nature continues to be pristine and true to itself in every form sentient or otherwise. While humans live in a manufactured construct of lies, scarcity, lack and so forth. Therefore, in a self-imposed confinement box of survival, survival mode leads to fear all the time. Life energy is ever busy loving and living itself in joyous expansion. It doesn't even know what scarcity is, for it has no lack of anything. Number three, the wise man must lead the pack, not the man with deep pockets. Yet even the wise man needs to learn to be in love and connection. That harmony in outcome in every interaction is the foundation upon which wisdom must work. All the knowledge in the world without love is meaningless drivel. Wise man must fall in love first. Universe is not based in policy, law or procedures, but a peaceful love song that abides and resounds in nurturing, caring and compassion. In which light can bloom, the light needs the love. The wise man must become lover first, only then he becomes as tender and as delicate as life itself, and therefore capable of leading with love and tenderness. The man who is only wise and knowledgeable without love only sees notes and scripts and cacophony. But when he pours the wisdom and knowledge into the cup of love and kindness, he becomes the music with which melody, with which he can dance with the rest of the earth. This is why even in 2022, humanity appears as the only discordant point in the cacophony on earth, while the rest of the earth and all beings upon it seemingly swimming in a sea of melody and harmony within themselves, pure beingness. This holistic approach is always the balance of love and light. It's always light which is knowledge, love which is the foundation. One is the heart, one is the head. There must be a balance point between both of these. We have yet to get there as a society, as individuals. I'll leave you with this much. Take care, be safe and be awesome as you are.